Now, for Creative Pros, we have to run with some compromises for a very long time because these glossy displays does a few things. Our human vision have a tendency to view these and see whatever creative work on these glossy display as having the perception of being sharper, more contrast, more saturation. However, some of us got so used to this, right? Because it's been around for the past 16 years that we may not think about it much, but these contrasts, these saturation increases have a tendency to not really show us the truth about our edit. And many users are now finding this out, and I have helped many users in this regard because many have edited on a glossy display and they would get a display at home, whether it would be something like another third party display, another Apple display with nano texture, or for example, a hardware calibrated display, especially if you're a photographer. And they would take their edit, what they have done on these glossy panels, or on their iMac for that matter, and view it on these matted panels, and they would just reach out to me and say, hey, it doesn't look as good. 